Hello, Hammerheads. Thanks for tuning in. Right, I ordered this from Amazon, you know, um, a couple of days ago. It's Thursday now, it's supposed to arrive tomorrow on Friday, but Amazon's usually early, unless they're dead late. See, lately I've been watching a lot of Alan Clark films. You know, the controversial British director. His films, all except one, are all, or plays, they're grim, dark, gritty, and brutally British. You know, he was always steeped in his controversy, his films. You know, and this one's no different from 1989. His very last film he directed. Alan Clark was well known. He was one of the pioneers of the Steadicam shot, wasn't he? As you see in a lot of his films, long shots of people walking along. <laughs> I watched Scum, both versions, the 1977 version and the theatrical 1979 version. It was the 1977 Play for the Day version that was banned by the BBC because it's deemed it too violent. I mean, it's the script's similar and everything. Obviously no F-bombs in that version because it's for TV. But everything happens the same and, you know, some of the different actors play in the same characters, you know. The only original screw in the theatrical one was Mr. Sands. They're all different in the 77 version. Even Housemaster, the governor and matron. Archer's even played by a different actor as well, David Frelfel. <laughs> Most of you will know him from Shameless as Frank Gallagher. <laughs> I never watched that. Right, yeah, and I watched Made in Britain. The film last night I watched called Contact. It's quite good as well. Elephant, another controversial film, also 1989. But this one, The Firm, this is the uncut version I've never seen. I've seen the other version doesn't at times. This is a special edition. You know, basically it's about, I'll read the synopsis. The Firm, a film by Alan Clark. The unflinching drama from the controversial director of Scum explores the violent world of football hooligan Bex Bissell, played by Gary Oldman, <clears throat> as he wages bloody war against rival gangs to decide who will lead a national firm into Europe to do battle with an in on an un international playing field. Originally censored prior to its broadcast, the firm has now been transferred in high definition for the very first time and is presented in two different versions including a director's cut which finally stores previously unseen material. Extensive extras include a newly recorded... I don't want to know about that. I mean you know when if you've ever seen it, you'll know what I mean. Most people have, if you're British. Um, chases Obo to his doorstep, him and his friend, and you just see him like that, don't you? <laughs> With a knife, and they run away. But apparently, in this version, he actually cuts his eyes out. <laughs> There's also a sex scene in it with him and his wife, what's wasn't in the cut version too, didn't I either, so... <laughs> um, yes, I shall be watching that very shortly. Mm, I'm glad I didn't get a Blu-ray. I wasn't sure if I accidentally got a Blu-ray or not, but I can't play Blu-rays anymore because my PlayStation 3 won't play them anymore. It used to, and I don't know why it doesn't anymore. It's a mystery, one of life's great mysteries of modern times anyway see you later i'm gonna have a look at this